Hi, I'm Tash. Welcome to Tash's Library. Today's video is just going to be a quick book tag, mainly because I have been unwell and haven't really been able to film. My voice is still a little bit croaky, so apologies. Hope it's okay. But I did watch a really cool video by Rekindled Reader where he did did this this or that book tag and I thought I haven't done this one yet so I've considered myself tagged and here we go question number one is paperback or hardback I have to go paperback for this one I love the feel of paperbacks and even though hardbacks look beautiful on a shelf I don't break the spines of my books and therefore paperbacks also look beautiful and they're just a lot easier to read particularly the floppy trade paperbacks number two harry potter or lord of the rings now i love harry potter but nothing nothing can beat lord of the rings i am obsessed i have read it several times i have watched the extended edition movies several times too many and i just absolutely adore the characters i absolutely absolutely adore the whole quest the world building you just cannot beat it it is my all-time favorite book and so lord of the rings is a definite winner here number three real books or ebooks tough one i do like ebooks because they're very convenient however i cannot beat the feel of a real book and i love real books so i think in this case i have to go real book number four buying or borrowing buying of course if i can afford it buying i love buying books it's i think it's a hobby in itself i love deciding which books i'm going to buy i love either going to a bookshop and buying them or ordering them and having them arrive in the mail so exciting uh, borrowing yes great if you need to but if i have the option buying is definitely it Number five, read in bed or read in a chair. Now, I do love reading in bed and I read in bed every single night without fail, but this chair here is my reading chair and this is probably where I do the vast majority of my reading in terms of hours. I definitely spend a, most of my evenings in this chair and yeah, so I'm gonna go read in chair. Number six, book club or read alone. I love reading alone and part of that is because I I like to read a book that I want to read so I have I like to create my own TBRs I like to also occasionally mood read for myself and the second I'm told I have to read a book that I haven't chosen I find that really difficult to do and and I also have very specific tastes so I love fantasy and sci-fi um, quite hard sometimes to get a book club that matches those interests and even then like even if you find someone who loves sci-fi they may love dystopian and I hate dystopian so I just find it I get to read more of what I want to read if I'm reading alone number seven library or bookstore bookstore of course um absolutely I love looking at bookstores I love the smell of new books absolutely adore the smell of new books I love looking at what's new in terms of new releases so i will always choose a bookstore um, having said that i also really appreciate what libraries offer however they also don't always have the same range i, I like yeah i like bookstores number eight non-fiction or fiction now i do like reading science non-fiction books i do enjoy those but without a doubt my answer is fiction i love reading fiction i love the escapism of fiction I love getting immersed into a new world and that's why particularly fantasy and sci-fi are my thing and definitely I'll always choose fiction over non-fiction. Number nine, new books or old books? New books, I think. Um, I do like the new things that come on the market. I love having a look at new releases. I enjoy seeing where books are going to at the moment i love the new diversity the new approaches the subversion of genres that are happening at the moment definitely will always go new in that sense 
Having said that, I also really appreciate some old books. I mean, of course, I've just said that Lord of the Rings is my all-time favorite, and that's real old school in a lot of ways, and I really appreciate some of those books, but I don't like classics or anything like that. I just find them a bit dull. And the last one is short chapters or long chapters. I'd have to go with short chapters because I like the sense of achievement. I, I get a little bit angsty sometimes and restless, and I like knowing that the chapter's gonna finish soon. I may continue reading for hours, but I kinda like that sense of satisfaction that I've completed a chapter. And I also like the option of stopping at the end of a chapter if I'm reading in bed, for example. Even though I won't always do so, and I'm happy to stop mid-chapter, but having the option to do so is really cool, and short chapters often provide that opportunities, much more than long chapters. Anyway, that is it. That's just a very, very quick book tag, just because I haven't made a video in a while, and I appreciate my subscribers, and I appreciate everyone who watches my videos, and I just thought you might like to hear from me occasionally. So thank you for watching and until I catch you next time, take care.